How's it going guys? It's Country Tactical here with Maverick and today we're going to be trying to make a World War One German uniform from Amazon for under $100. This one should be better than the Walmart World War One German uniform as now since we're shopping from Amazon we have a lot more options of what we can choose. If you're from a different country than the US that doesn't have Walmart you could also kind of replicate this Amazon uniform because Amazon's pretty much everywhere I think. Hmm. Also I got a new haircut. What sure. do you guys think? comment down below and a lot of you guys requested this uniform so keep leaving now suggestions on what amazon uniform we should make next but yeah you could use this for school presentations airsoft theater hanging out hanging out with your friends i don't know but you cannot use it for official reenactments as this is not you know accurate this is barb so just keep that in mind and uh now let's get to amazon let's go ah. how's it going guys it's country tactical here with my great pickle abba And today I'm going to be trying to make a World War One German uniform from Amazon for under $100. A lot of you guys requested me to do this and I think it's a pretty good idea. So let's go ahead and try to make it. The first thing we're going to want is some sort of boots. Now from Walmart we got their water boots and they actually turned out and worked out really well. So we're going to try to get water boots from Amazon because they shouldn't be too costly. I would try, you know, a boots putties combination but that will probably bring us over $100. So let's try to find some cheap boots. Water boots. Let's see, 45, there's these. Well, these boots actually look pretty good. I don't really like the uh, like molds and designs on them. If you found some boots without all these designs, I'd probably get that because it just doesn't look that realistic. But they're the cheapest I could find so far. I'm gonna go ahead and probably get a size 13 because that's Maverick size. I'm trying to make this for him. God, this is actually pretty cheap. It's only like 11.49, it's on sale. Now I'm gonna make a list, create list. What should I name it? Amazon Imperial German. That should be good. All right, we got our first item done, which is the boots. Now we're gonna move on to some sort of pants. Probably gonna get something like we did in the World War II American. We got joggers last time, and I really like those because not only were they like really baggy, but you know, the thicker kind of texture of it made it look like wool. So we're gonna try to find some um, gray sweatpants for men. Hmm. See, there's our, these are light gray. I want to type in dark gray. Dark gray. A little bit costly. I want them a little bit cheaper. Ooh. Ah, it's not prime. What? XXXX large is prime. And it's really cheap. Maverick's actually pretty tall, so these might work. And look, they're straight leg. I feel like these would work. They're extra, extra large, though. I like the color. It should work. It's almost like a wool texture. That's part of the reason I like them. Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and get them. All right. Now it's time for the tunic. For the tunic, I'm probably going to get something, uh, I don't know, gray tunic. Women's stuff. Gray military tunic. Uh, nope. Gray military shirt. Men's buck flannel shirt. It's kind of cool. Man, I really want something similar to the, uh, the thing we got for the World War II Amazon. Oh, this looks kind of cool. I'm trying to find something cheaper, man. Okay guys, I'm finally back. I did a ton of looking and I finally think I found something that will be adequate for a World War One German tunic from Amazon. The pretty much the best thing I could find is almost like a trench coat, which they had and would look pretty cool and a lot of people like trench coats. So I think we're gonna go with that. I wasn't expecting that, but it's probably gonna be our best option. As you can see here, this looks really wool. It's long and it's pretty much the perfect color. I was gonna size for Maverick, which is a large and it's only 40 bucks <laughs> i hope it turns out good but i'm gonna go ahead and add it to the list i'm so thankful i found something i've been looking for so freaking long now next up we need to start making the webbing and i'm gonna try to find black y strap suspenders black now we want to get y strap because that's the most accurate wow these are actually pretty good right here i mean they're kind of thin but eight dollars and 88 cents it's pretty good okay i found these they got 3,000 ratings and they're pretty good and how much are they to I guess I'll get these. I think these will be the best. They look decently wide. But compared to the- wait a minute. What? Dude, every time I go through Amazon, I find cheaper deals. This is six dollars. 
how is it six dollars and it's not even that bad dude six bucks how could i pass that up man this is a gamble this is a gamble i'm not gonna lie there's 28 ratings that could be fake ratings i don't know i'm gonna get it and we're gonna see how it's like <laughs> they're just so good they're too good to pass up sorry all right we got the suspenders now we need a belt like a world war one german belt germ because maybe we could have enough money to get authentic stuff see it's just 40 bucks if you get older. I mean, you could buy a, a belt when you're younger. It might not fit you, but it could be a starter thing. I'm not going to buy one. I'm just going to find a cheap little black belt. Black leather belt. Black leather belt. 13. Kind of expensive. I don't really like leather belts because they're, usually they're fake. What about black canvas belt? Because it'd be hard to tell that it's not leather. I wonder how I get it brown canvas nah since i got the black wide straps i want to get the black belt there's this for eight bucks this one's similar to the american one we got and that turned out really well i like that belt buckle <laughs> you know what i'll get this since it's cheap and reliable i'm gonna get this so that's the belt now what we need is a you know headgear so i'm gonna look up world war one german helmet and let's see what we get Nicky Biggs has his pickle habas. What about these? Okay, those are expensive. Dang, you have a lot of pickle haba options on Amazon. Not quite what I'm looking for because they're too expensive. We're trying to do something cheap. I'm gonna look up toys, see if I can get cheap. Nicky Biggs. That's World War II, I think. That's a classic stall helm for 20 bucks. Look at this though. This is nine bucks and it looks pretty good. It looks kind of like this. It's just, you know, it's not metal, it's fake, but that's an option. Can I get any cheaper? Eh. I think it'll be fine. Nine dollars for uh, the hat? That's great. And it's on sale. Seems like it goes through a lot of price changes. Price change. It goes all around, I guess. The cheapest it was, wow, is eight bucks. Hmm. Now let's go ahead and see the list. I'm gonna take a look at it and see how much all of this cost. It looks like we pretty much got everything. I'm gonna add this all to cart. I marked, I marked the cart. Let's see, we got six items in the card. Total price is $86? God, that's great. Dude, oh, not breaking my freaking bank. And this this might look good. I mean, for Halloween or just a little airsoft beginning, you know, you kind of want to get the feel of a World War One German before you start spending a lot of money. This could possibly be your option. You know, since we're only $86 in and we still have, you know, the $100 budget, I'm going to add an Imperial German flag. World War One German flag so you can show your German pride off wow they're even prime as well that's sweet that's so cheap right there look at that oh my gosh I'm gonna go ahead and get this it has 101 reviews all is five stars yes I'm getting this I'm getting this I'm just adding it to cart okay we got all this stuff we got the flag we got the helmet we got the belt we got the suspenders we got the trench coat we got the pants and we got the boots for $93 look at that that's really good I'm gonna go ahead and proceed to checkout we're buying this we're buying this right now baby I got a $5 coupon as well Wow I'll get the flag pretty quick Wow okay ah oh, dude the boots aren't prime no why are they not prime it says they're prime fell dude it says it's prime right there I'm gonna look for something that says big old prime. So these are $14 and it says they're prime. These are size 12. Well, I hope these can fit Maverick. I'm gonna add these to cart, see if they're actually prime and not lying. These boots are prime, but they are size 12. Maverick's size 13. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. I'm gonna go ahead and remove these other boots. They're only like $3 more. It doesn't really matter. I just wanna get this shipped so I can make the video. And these are ugly. These don't, these don't look really black. With the quick update, now we got these boots. We got the flag, the helmet, belt, suspenders, overcoat, and pants. And the total is $96, let's so see how much it is with tax. And apparently we got a $5 coupon, so I'm gonna take advantage of that, because why not? Dude, that's crazy. It's crazy how it's $98, and everything should ship fairly quickly. Place my order, baby. Let's see what we get. Oh yeah, Maverick doesn't really like pickle hobbies. He's not gonna like it that much, but we just ordered it. Can't wait to get it. Try it out. Should be really cool. Pretty fun to make. I'm actually quite glad that we got the overcoat because I think that'll be something new and it could be used for winter because a lot of you guys were requesting like a German winter uniform. So I might put the title as that. I don't really know yet. Just earned $100 at 98. It's making up for the World War II American uniform. I'll catch you guys when we get the stuff. Okay, guys. We have the World War One German Amazon uniform from Amazon. <laughs> we got Maverick, of course. He's going to be testing it out and seeing how good it is. And we just got to pretty much unbox it. Unboxing video. Let's go. Now, here's your knife. We got the trusty bolo. We're getting the first package open. Feel like Christmas? It feels better than Christmas because I'm actually getting something I want. 
Oh wow, look at that. I did get the pickle hobbit even though you hate it. <laughs> Yay! Be happy, be happy, be thankful. Thanksgiving was like a while ago. It was two days ago? Oh goodness. At least it's a nice one. Yep, we got the first item. Looks like we're gonna have to screw on the spike. What is this? Good. Oh, these are the pants. It's hard to tell the colors on yeah. Amazon. Sometimes they turn out a little bit different, so I'm kind of scared. But I think it should be right. The reason I got this is because it kind of has a woolen texture. I mean, these are pretty close, actually, yeah. They look like they're going to be a tad bit big, but that's, that's okay good. because we're going to put the boots over it. And we'll get the bagginess. And we'll get the bagginess, exactly. Oh my gosh, what is this? Is this a flag? <laughs> oh, yeah. that's actually really cool. Yeah, I got the flag. Go ahead it's and open a little... it. This one actually turned out quite a bit cheaper. It was uh, like $93, so I went ahead and bought the flag. I mean, hey, that's a pretty decent size. That's a nice flag, actually. I really like this. That looks great, dude. Oh, well, I actually really like this. This is uh, sure. Does the master pants good? Wow. I, hey. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. This is very nice. I, I'd wear this regardless. Dang, how much did that order? I forgot about this because I ordered this like a little bit ago. Ooh. Brand new booties for Mav. That's Putin. Dude, these are steel toe. I forgot it said they're steel toe. I was like, what the heck? Yes. <laughs> steel toe. I love steel toe. <laughs> steel toe is superior. Just like the German vol machine. Steel toe. Let's go. Now, what is this small one? There's the belt. And here's the suspenders. Okay. I mean, these are the Y strap, by the way. This is going to be pretty good. That should be everything. So let's go ahead and start piecing it together and see how it turns out. Because I'm pretty excited for this one. I think it's more exciting for Amazon on boxings or just putting the uniform together because you really don't know what you're getting into well guys we got it all out right here and i think it's just about time to throw it on first up is the pants and the boots so go ahead and put that on oh this is actually it's not like it's not that bad an amazing fit but it's not that, that turkey dinner really helped out shut up <laughs> well i tried to get size 13 but they weren't prime these are prime however but they're 12 we'll see how they fit there no no i'll tuck it in you know? oh you're right <laughs> I'm a maverick. Shut up. I'm th I'm too Texan. Texans don't do this. Girls do. So how does it fit? Nice, actually. How do, how do you like that steel toe? It's nice. Wow. I like the bagginess. I think the bagginess is looking pretty good. It does. I agree. Uh, it looks just about how a actual German uniform should with the bagginess. It's like not too baggy. I don't like the boots as much because of the little designs that they put on them. And the more. logo on them. Yeah, let me fix that real quick. Dude, this thing's like blowing up in my hand. Lens all dry. I need to wash my hands though. <laughs> Time for the coat. Yay! So, dang, dude, I think it this is. This is nice. I like this coat. I did a lot of looking. I did so much looking to find this because I was trying to find just a normal one. And I think it's worth it. And it covers up the buttons as well, so it looks like the late war German uniform. Wow. I think it's pretty good. Got a similar belt with ah! ribbon. They're a bit skinnier than I wanted, but they're the cheapest. Little baby suspenders. These are baby suspenders, I agree. <laughs> Everything that goes wrong, it's because Maverick's fat. <laughs> there you go, got the Y strap. Remember to always make it looser than tighter because you don't want a tight webbing set up. Yeah. It's you gotta looser it up a little bit. Bam, a new Bam. Man. That looks good. I think the webbing actually looks remarkable. Look. That webbing turned out quite nice. Turn around. There we go. Now let's put on the pickle hobble. The pickle hobble. We gotta screw the spike on. Man, he's looking pretty good. $100 uh, Amazon German uniform. There we go. <laughs> All right, there let's go, go ahead and do that snap. Wow. That's actually looking really good. It, it turned does. out nice. The coat looks really nice. The uh, webbing actually turned out really good. The boots aren't too bad. This has the right bagginess, so it looks nice. And the pickle haba, the best part of it. <laughs> yeah, always. No, but the, the pickle haba does look pretty good. I mean, hey, it's an early war. He's an early war German. And let's go out there, shoot some guns, and take a better look at yes. it. Yes. Maverick, he's going off to war. He's an early war. German. Ready for winter because he got the long trench coat. I don't matter. And he's ready to serve his country. It won't matter if we are ready for winter. We are going to be home by Christmas, don't you know? Yes, of course. Now, I think that's a French couch, so you need to go ahead and uh, show your Prussian pride. 
He uh, captured a uh, German, I mean uh, a Russian's Mosin and Gaunt. Let's go, Maverick! <laughs> this looks great. We took the flag off, now we're gonna see Mav crouch. Dude, I think one of the things already broke off. Go ahead and sh sh shoot at it. I think we need to charge at that couch right now. Put your pride back on. I need to call Woodsman James. I need Woodsman James right now to fight the wind. Fight. Okay guys, so we're about to charge that French couch down there. But can we get this brave young German 1914 likes? And if you're new, feel free to subscribe, check out the merch, and we can do more awesome videos like this from Amazon. Remember to leave a like and comment down what uniform you guys want to see from Amazon next. Are you ready? Langen sehen, mein Bruder! God, he went right through him. Get him, get him, get him! Beat the shit out of him! Yes, sir! Tackle him! Get him, Maverick! Bring him up! Hold on, hand! <laughs> he passed out. He fought well for his country. Well, remember to get 1914 likes for this brave young soldier and what he did for his country. He's not giving up. Whoa! Ew! Ew! That was a French spirit. Oh! Good Maverick. Like and subscribe.